Hello everybody and welcome back to Old School RuneScape. And it's been way too long since I played. Uh, yeah, 56 days since I last played. And I do apologize, but things have been going on. So let me tell you what has happened since I last played. First of all, I got married. Talked about that a bit. It happened. It was great. Went on my honeymoon. I moved to an apartment. I'm still in the process of moving. I've been working my job. It's still full time. And yeah, that's what's been going on. That's why I have not had time to record. I had intended to be more on top of things, you know, beforehand, but when December finally got here, I was way behind and it did not go well. But we are back. I just bought the Premier Club, which was ridiculously expensive for this year, but means we should have all the fancy things. We missed the Christmas event. It was removed today, sadly. If I had known, I might have tried to record yesterday, though I didn't really have the time. But we missed out on that. Uh, it's not a big deal. They, they don't do anything too amazing, I think, and you usually get certain things the next year anyway. Um, but the big thing is, and the reason why I've gone out of my way to record today, is the message of the week. The new, uh, continent. Zia, Zaya, I don't know how to pronounce it, I should have probably watched one of the videos, the many videos they released talking about it. And I've not really read much about it, honestly. I've been completely out of the RuneScape loop, I have not even been playing my main account. Which, luckily, re reverted back to my ancient uh, monthly payment, otherwise I would have lost my $5 a month uh, uh, loyalty price that I've got from being a member for who knows how many years. Uh, but here we are, we were doing whatever it is we were doing. Were we doing a quest? Am I in the middle of a quest? Yeah, I guess. Watchtower quest. Well, sadly, that is going to go on hold right now. I don't even remember what I was doing here. I was going to do something with these guys, I think. Kill someone? I don't know. I probably already killed him. Or knocked out his tooth or something. We'll come back to this. I'll rewatch the video and figure out what we're doing there. But what I do know is I do know we need to go to Port Serum. I do know that they said there was no limits. They said anyone can go there. So I'm going to assume we can actually go to the new continent without having to do anything crazy. Hey look, there's an ant. let's kill it. I haven't killed anything in so long. Uh, I missed RuneScape, I just have not had time. Ooh, a yellow bead, that might be worth some small amount of change. Let's just get over to Draenor Bank and we can bank all this crap we got. But yeah, I've been completely out of the loop. I have not been checking up on updates in RuneScape 3 or anything, but I did find out via Twitter that they're going to be opening up the original RuneScape Classic. You know, the RuneScape 1 that has been closed for years. It's going to be open again to members, and I haven't found a news post. I, there's probably one somewhere, but I don't know the details for sure. I don't know if it's like if you log in during a time period, you can forever access it, if they're just permanently reopening it. This is part of the 15th anniversary celebrations. It's apparently the 15th anniversary. They got some things going on in RuneScape 3. Who knows, maybe they have something in uh, Old School as well. I just don't know about it, but I'm definitely going to record another episode before the next update. So if there is anything else to be done related to that, I will hopefully not miss out on it. Relic Part 3. Yeah, I don't know what was going on there. I don't think we'll bring anything, really. We'll just have my armor, and hopefully I don't get killed by some mysterious new thing on this continent. I am glad this update came out. I didn't I didn't even realize time's been flying for the past month or two, so yeah, I didn't realize it was already here until, you know, a few days ago when they started posting on Twitter, it's coming this week, and I was like, oh crap. I should probably get back on schedule with recording. It's, I'm also a bit disappointed that this had to happen immediately after I had the idea to start the Orbscape channel. It was not a good start to a channel, but, you know, I guess if it had to happen, it might as well have been right at the start rather than after I had built things up a bit. So, there's that. Uh, I'll try to get back on RuneScape 3 and 
maybe the dead man mode and darkscape this week or definitely next week i'll try to have my goal this month basically is to get everything back to normal on both channels and looks like we'll also have a runescape classic series which i've never put much time into runescape classic because i mentioned before uh i made an account on there i don't know like probably 2005 or 6 or something and for some reason I couldn't tell which character was a boy and which one was a girl, and I accidentally made my character a girl. I think I might have passed the guy. But yeah, so I never really played it, because for some reason that just bugged me having my main account be a girl on there. I don't really know why. Is it going to be over here? Oh, this is probably him. I don't recognize his face. Or maybe it's even further down. I don't remember this being so long. Oh, it's this guy over here, duh. But yeah, for some reason, I never really got into it because of that. Because there's no makeover made. You cannot change your character once you've made it. It was very sad. But I will definitely be doing a series, and that way it'll actually be something that I'm not that knowledgeable in, you know? For the most part, I know a lot of things about Old School and RuneScape 3, and maybe to a lesser extent Darkscape and Deadman. Because now I'm out of the loop. I have not been paying enough attention to anything. Okay, um... Well, that was fancy. Cool. And got some, what sounds like new music. Corinne the Magnificent. Magnificent. Right, okay, we got a spider, apparently. I wonder how much new stuff there is. Like, graphically, and in terms of things like... Monsters and stuff. It'll be interesting. I wonder if there's any new quests. Hmm. I don't know. I really don't know what's over here. I doubt there's any quests. I want there to be, though, but... I'm not seeing any. Unless they made a new non-members one, but I would have noticed that. So I guess no quests to start. I think only one section of this area is available. A city? Grind, I guess. That's, a. Uh, new graphic for pirates, isn't it? Maybe. Uh, okay, we got some mining stuff, broken boat, seagulls, and whatever the heck is going on over here. That's a pet baby, um, uh, cow fight queen. That's what that was. I know what I'm talking about. Okay, I do know we, get, we gotta gain, uh, prestige or standing or something to do with these guys. Let's see what Leans has to trade in. Apparently you unlock things. Wow, that's a lot of pots. Uh, I wonder how we repair this thing. I'm guessing we get some percentage. I wonder if it's like, uh, I guess I can't do that then. I wonder if it's like a uh, miscellanea where the percentage goes down each day, because otherwise it seems a bit silly to have this, unless Unless it's really hard to get 100%. I could see if it's like getting a 99, then I could see having that permanently up there being a thing. But if it's real easy, then obviously it'd be a bit silly. So I'm going to assume it's one of those two things. It's either a really hard to do, or it slowly goes down over time. Destroyed furniture, huh? These are very nice graphics. I'd seen some images related to this on Twitter. So, I guess we, uh, I wish I knew where to go, but we can't repair stuff, apparently. What is going on in here? What is this? Blue cups? I don't know. Where is someone I can talk to? Captain Khalid. 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 I don't know. Let's talk to him. I've got nothing to say to you. 75% favor. That's what I need. Well, okay, so Piscalarius, obviously... The pisk is, uh, related to fishing, because something, yeah, piscatoris, you know. I know it comes from, like, Latin or some other language, I just don't know which. But means something related to fish or fishing, you know, Pisces and all that. Yeah. I don't think it's Piscatoris, though. Could be wrong. I don't know pronunciations of anything. Uh, oh gosh, Swarm. What's he doing here? Nothing much. Just hanging around. Well, anyway. We found the bank! Hooray! I really wish there was an in-game map for this. 
I do have the map here. Okay, so yeah, there's four pieces. Four pieces to the city, favor and tasks. I'm reading this. Five houses, apparently. There's one in the middle, I guess. Like a ruling house, I would assume. Let's try to get to the middle, then. I don't know what this uh, river, or whatever this is, has to do with anything. I'm afraid this is probably not going to be the most uh, helpful or informational episode, because it's sort of a return from hiatus, also look at this giant update I don't know anything about type situation. Patrol man! He's new. I've never seen that clothing before. I have seen a glitch related to that clothing on Twitter, though. And it was really funny looking. Very nice. Okay, we got some houses up here. This place is huge, but I wonder wonder how uh, big it is compared to the overall size of the uh, entire continent, because I want this continent to be the same size as the main one. Speaking of which, what is the name of the main continent? Have they named it? Because the planet's Gilinor, right? Unless they've named the continent that. I cannot get anywhere from here. I'm just stuck. I don't know, there's not much to do in this city, it would seem. Just whatever skilling things each uh, house has. I mean, we got poor looking man, what's he got to say to us? Probably says, get your agility higher so you can quit walking. Hey there, is this where you live? Yes it is, don't look down your nose at me. I have to put up with an awful lot to earn my living. Life is a daily struggle. Sorry, I'm just curious. Why is life so difficult here? Look, this is none of your business. I'd appreciate it if you left me to it. I don't want to see another fancy adventurer again. Okay, okay, I'll be off now. Very nice, very nice. Let's go upstairs. Just looking around your house, don't mind me. Maybe he has something valuable. No, didn't think so. You know, he's poor looking. I wonder if they've got quests planned for a lot of these NPCs. That would be cool. Because I think... From here on out, they should probably do a lot of updates, like standard runescape updates related to this continent, because they can do things without it being confusing. Because it's confusing if they do updates that differ from runescape in the main runescape area. Like, oh yeah, we're going to completely redesign Varrock and rename it, I don't know, Potato Land. It's a very interesting look there. Well, I'm lost. This sucks. Uh, do I have... I do have! Let's recharge my energy so we can run around a bit. I imagine there's probably a main road that leads to the center, then. If we can't get from over there, then maybe we can get from right here? I don't know, this looks like the docks. Is this where I came from? Am I going the wrong way entirely? It's possible. It's completely possible that I am just totally lost right now. Hey, this looks promising, though. Look at all these rocks. Let's check them out. There's a tin bath? Okay. Yeah, I, I wish there was a person who walked up to you when you first arrived that was like, hey, do this, do that, because I don't know. Okay, I've got to find a map. There is no way I'm going to figure this out. Ah, click here to see a full-size map. Yes, please. Thank you. Oh, so it's, it's to the northwest. That's interesting. I never expected that. I really thought that it would be to the uh, east. But uh, shows what I know. Okay, so actually, south of the rocks is where we want to go. I was trying to get up to this huge rocky area, and I don't really want to do that. For some reason, I assumed that I'd come in in the southeastern corner. I really don't know why I thought that, but, you know, it's a thing. Look at that. That's some nice graphics there. Whoa, what, what was that? Okay, I was not expecting some sort of... Um... I wonder what this is about. Uh... <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. What in the heck is going on here? Is there PKing here? Because, yeah. If he expects me to tell him anything, 
Maybe they're how you gain favor, I don't know. I like these graphics though, these are definitely a nice little thing. Is this taken from from the one thing? Whatever. The uh, mini game. Whatever it is. A uh, Vine Sweeper. W25, apparently. So I guess, what is this one? Then this is, uh, I've accidentally wandered into Hosidius House. This is the tithe farm, apparently. So they got some sort of tithing system where you gotta work on the farm? I don't know. They got a lot of wheat. I was kind of hoping for new crops, not just more of the same. But hey, there's probably some new seeds or something. I was not expecting a greenhouse, I'll admit. Look at this crap. Yeah, this is basically just walking around Zaya. This is all this episode is going to be. But maybe I can figure out what to do. Let's see. I am at least interested in this one more than I am in the fishing one. Let's look it up. Hosidius, farming and cooking. They specialize in agriculture. Uh, fast parse, fast parse, a fast paced farming mini game. Okay, where you oversee the growth of several exotic plants. Looks like it happens not right here. Back to the map. It's probably, uh, probably one of the purple things this guy's talking about, right? I would imagine. So those are over here. Let's figure it out, because I would imagine those are things that mark how you gain favor. Because it's a purple symbol like one of these things. And that's usually an activity or something. You know, quest, uh, minigame, and achievement diary. So I would assume favor gaining stuff would be purple. It just makes sense. I guess. Got a lot of people who are high level, and I'm just this low level, uh, level 44 noob. Oh my gosh, I'd forgotten how newbie I was in this game. It must be rectified. Alright, so there should be one somewhere in this general area. What is going on here? Tipped that bowl. What are they talking about? Bowl tipping? That sounds pretty dangerous. Okay, um... Oh, I'm not even close to west enough. Right, continuing on. This is a pretty big city, definitely. Biggest city in the game, probably. Uh, oak trees, we could chop those. Got some more farming stuff with some farmers. You guys aren't growing anything. You do realize that, right? Okay, we got a round table. I like all these trees, this line of trees. It's very farm-like. Like a man-made structure type thing that you don't really see in RuneScape. You just see paths with a bunch of random trees, but it's like these were actually planted there. Little details like that are nice. Okay, what is going on here? <laughs> okay. It, it got very crazy for a second. Oh, this was the cooking place, isn't it? A cooking minigame. What's our cooking level? 28? I'm not confident in our ability to do this, since it, we needed crafting 30 for the crafting one. It's gonna suck if we need level 30, because what, we could do mining and smithing. And... I don't know, because I don't think there's agility. Pretty sure there is smithing, though. Pretty sure there is... Oh, there's Magic Rune Crafting Prayer. And mining and smithing, farming, cooking, and fishing, thieving, and uh, I guess some sort of combat-y one. I don't know, it's not very specific about the skills on some of them. A bit generic, actually. Why is the icon right there when you obviously have to go in here? Oh, we can serve. You're not authorized to work in my kitchen. I need... Well... How do I... Hmm... Can I talk to him and figure out what I'm supposed to do? Do I have to go farm first? Uh, yeah, I can do some cooking. Uh, when I've got more favor... <laughs> well, I... Okay, I'll try the other purple dot. It is nearby. Um, but 
not confident. Oh, there's another one to the southeast near a bank. I think that's the one that looks to be farming. So we'll try that one out. I want to get something done in this episode. Holy crap, we're 20 minutes in and all I've done is wander around uh, half the city. Haven't even seen the other half. It's great. It's good stuff. Great start to the new continent there. Uh, we got some roses. Very nice. And cabbage and potatoes. They should have taken this as an opportunity to add a whole bunch of new uh, food items. Like, I don't know. Carrots as a growable thing, maybe? I don't know. I have trouble remembering what's already in the game right now. It's like sweet corn, tomatoes, onions, potatoes, lettuce, strawberries, blah blah blah. I think it's right around here that we need to go. Hey, maple trees! Not bad, we could chop here. There's a bank right here. This actually looks to be a really good maple chopping place. And we got prayer right there if you for some reason wanted to use prayer. And I think it's around here, if my memory serves me correctly. There it is. Okay, uh, are you a player? You're a player. What is it? The tool up leprechaun? What is going on here? Why is there an icon but no NPCs? Spirit tree patch. Ooh, that's fancy. Oh, there's, there's two of them, apparently. What is the deal with these pits? Oh, what is this? A mature juniper tree. What level does it take? Oh, I don't have an axe with me. I would assume that maybe you chop down juniper trees and do something. What the heck? Okay, that's a bit unusual. Oh, here we go. I have discovered a thing. I'm probably gonna need to get a spade, I would imagine, but there is a bank nearby. Yeah. Okay, so we dig in the saltpeter and do something with it, I would assume. I'm assuming you don't get favor just from digging up saltpeter. That'd be a bit strange. Okay, uh, where do I keep my spades? They're not near the top, are they? I, I just saw them. I, I moved my eyes over them, I think. Unless I saw something else. There they are. Oh, they're in tab two, so I didn't see them. Wait, what? Tab 2? Oh, it starts at 0. Okay, it's in farming, I get it. I can dig on the ground! Okay, right, quick, quick, while well, there's still some left. Oh, crap. Oh, is it- can you sell it? Why would you sell it? What purpose does it serve? Oh, it can make fertilizer, apparently, okay. Hmm. Well, that's interesting, and not what I expected at all, actually. Uh, let me read up on this house here. Okay, we can help with the production of farmed foods and preparing food. The Tide minigame. Hmm. Yeah, they're not very detailed on this, actually. It's not good. Okay, keep digging there. It's not good that it stops digging. I don't like it. Not a fan. And I did notice just now that the graphics are pausing whenever I leave the window, which they didn't used to do that. I'm not sure what that's about, so sorry about any pauses that have happened, but I've been browsing the, uh, the internet, trying to figure things out, and apparently uh, RuneScape has decided Oh, it's only when I minimize, I guess. Okay, that's fine, I suppose. I just have to not minimize and it'll be fine. I don't know what to do, honestly. We can collect more of this saltpeter. I should probably check a wiki is what I should do. Okay, um... I still remember the link to the wiki. Because I am that good. Right, so, um... I'll just go to the Zaya. Page. Alright. Great Currend. Got it. Asidius. Plow the fields around Asidius is what I can do. Alright. Um, plow the fields. Hey, would you look at that? We can push the plow. I didn't notice that before. Good job, me. We got time to do something now. 
So, am I gonna get experience for this, is my question. Farming XP? Please give me farming XP. Yeah, okay, I wanna push it from this side, actually. Which, I guess, doesn't really work. Oh, it does! Okay... A hammer? Okay, I wasn't expecting that. Right, um, nearest bank to me now is a mystery, because I have closed the map, and therefore cannot see what I'm doing anymore. Alright, um, nearest bank is the one I was at before, sadly. Alright, let's run all the way over there. I'm gonna try to get something accomplished in this episode, even if it's just to obtain the next ability to train in this stupid town. Can I do another one of these? I can. Alright, let's get on over here. I should probably just toss all my armor so we can run further, because I'm not planning on doing any combat in the near future. But whatever. So I guess we're probably going to be spending a, a handful of episodes in this town before we go back and finish up our adventures in whatever land. Oh, I can't equip like that. It was a hammer that I needed, which... Hammer is right there. For some reason, I looked at it and didn't recognize it visually as a hammer. Don't ask me why. I really don't know. I'm going to guess that these juniper trees require higher than level 49 to chop down. But I'm going to click on it just to see what it says. I wonder if there... Oh! Hmm! Okay. It gives 35 experience. Isn't that around Willow level experience? Or... No, I'm thinking... No, that's like very low level. Hmm. Uh... Juniper trees. Level 42, though. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Hey! Did it... No, wait, that's the one I was using before. But who cares? Let's get on in this one. This one looks more to my style. I think I like this area, though. I don't like the music, though. This music... Can we listen to something less country, please? Because that's just getting obnoxious. Alright, so how much of this do I have to do before we obtain something? Or do the lines go away and then you have to do it? Because if that's the case, then we're never going to be able to do it. I'm sorry to say. So I can only hope that we are somehow obtaining something of value here. Okay. Well, there's someone else over there doing it, but I'm not gaining anything. Okay, I was at least right in assuming you can do that, but we gotta do this until 5% and... Maybe it jumps in large increments. Hey, look at that. Oh, God. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay. Do I get anything for repairing it? Hey, I do. 10 crafting experience. Not bad. So, yeah, this is definitely something that I'm going to do outside of the recording. I'll get us up to, like, 4.9% or something, and then we'll do the next episode, because I don't even want to know how long this takes. Wow. It definitely is not the most impressive training thing to be stuck doing. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just plowing in this direction now. I'm gonna plow all over the place. I'm being so helpful, guys. I'm plowing the same field over and over. I cannot be stopped. I hope it doesn't keep track, because that would suck. Still at 0.1%. I want to get to 0.2%. It can be done. Man, if it does go down in that case... No, it's just gotta be, like, it takes forever. Because I would not want to get stuck doing this again after doing it for who knows how long. Feels like it's gonna be, you know, hours. But hopefully that's just me being a pessimist, and uh, maybe you do have to. No, there's 0.2% there. Oh, does he keep pushing on his own? Have I been pushing for no reason? In fact, oh. Is it faster if you don't keep clicking? It is. Okay, well that's... 
That's annoying, okay? Because that's not at all how things generally work in old school. Because this was back before tasks generally auto-continued. So I was not expecting that. Okay, this isn't so bad then. Uh, it's still annoying, but it's a heck of a lot less annoying than I was expecting based on things. So yeah, that is a very, very tiny look at about half-ish of Zaya, Zia, Z, I don't know. I'll figure out how to pronounce it, guys. Don't worry. Maybe I'll watch one of the videos and actually know how to do things next time. But either way, I will get this. That time I didn't get anything, did I? Hmm. I don't know. Things could be wrong. We will never know. But yeah, I'll, I'll try to figure some things out before the next episode. I just wanted to go ahead and get back in the swing of things not put it off any longer. And that is how we got this episode. But yeah, this has been Kebab799. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe to see more. Like this video if you liked it. Comment if you have anything to say. And I will see you in the next episode.